go to the final thing here, and then we've only got one more thing to go to, of course, after this. And that's this, is how this 401k thing works. Anybody know? I'll show you anyway. You're saying, I thought we came here for you to tell us stuff like this. Of course. So here's how it works. This is a, the Cliff's Notes version. It's a little more complicated than this, but not much more complicated. You go to work for somebody. They say, we're going to pay you $50,000. Would you like to participate in our 401k plan? You go, I don't know. What's that? And they say, well, if you participate, you can forego a portion of your salary, and we'll take it and put it in a 401k account. You say, how much can I put in? They say, yep, I'm making this up. Up to $5,000 at our company. So you say, okay, I would like to play. Keep $5,000. So I'm only going to take home $45,000. The $5,000 I leave in there goes over in a 401k account. The 401k account is not administered by the company. It's administered by somebody that's a professional what are called fiduciaries, are people that handle your money, that know that it's your money, not the company's money. And they're looking out for you. Very heavily regulated. The government's got your back, if that you know, gives you any comfort at all. Sometimes it doesn't. Highly regulated, seriously. They're watching out for you. The employer can't do bad things with your money. They can't, because they're not even holding it. It's being held by somebody else and a professional company, and they offer you a variety of investment alternatives. You can invest in this at a fairly low return, bonds and money market funds and certificates of deposit, or this is riskier and you can invest in this and you might make a lot of money or you could lose some money. You put your money in there, you don't pay tax on that $5,000. You only pay tax on what you actually get. The money stays in there tax-free. It grows exponentially if you make the right investment decisions and you pay tax later when you're ready to take it out. So you don't pay any tax now, you pay the tax later. That's the simple version. The beauty of it is, is that a lot of employers match a certain percentage. They may match 20% or 50% or even 100%. In rare cases, they may match more than 100%. You put in a dollar, they put in you know, 20 cents. You put in a dollar, they put in 50 cents. It's a pretty cool thing. Many of you will be offered this. It's a very, very popular plan. It replaced most of the traditional pension plans from 50, 100 years ago. Companies don't offer those as much anymore. So here's the thing, and this is, and we're going to go on to the next thing after this. It's very important that if you have the opportunity to do this, you take maximum advantage of this. And a lot of times people don't do it. And the reason they don't do it is because you move from Orlando to LA or New York, or wherever, Atlanta, and you get your dream job, and you start working there, and they say, are you ready to participate in the 401k? And you say, well, let me think back here. Okay, this guy Cook talked to us about it. He said it was important, but I'm in LA, and I'm making 50 grand, and it's kind of expensive, and I don't know. And uh, tell you what, why don't you hit me next year, because I think I'm gonna try to get my feet on the ground here, and I'm gonna pass right now, and I'm going to do it later. Well, you know what happens is later really never happens because cost of living goes up and you never quite want to part with the $5,000. So here's what I would tell you. Whenever you have the opportunity to, to participate in any 401k plan from any company on the planet that you may choose to work for, and they offer you to participate, and you say, you know, I'm going to have to pass and check me next year, that is your decision, and nobody, and I emphasize nobody, can force you to participate if you don't want to. However, I can force you to do one thing. And you're thinking, wait a minute, how can he force us to? He's not even our teacher. He's just some guy doing a seminar real quick in the auditorium. I can do this. If you refuse to participate in a 401k plan, knowing what you know now, then you can do that anytime you want, provided, and this is a requirement, that you never, 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 ever tell anybody that you ever had me as a teacher, period. Because what they're trying to do is give you free money. And what you just said was, no thank you. I don't need any free money. I'm good. So please don't give me any free money. And people like that aren't very smart. And I'm sure all of you folks are smart. 
So I swear I will disown all of you if you ever pass on free money. When somebody offers you free money, you usually extend your hand and you say, may I please have some more? <laughs> so, because they're giving you free money, so by all means take it. Tax advantages plus, did I mention, mm, free money. So you get the idea, extremely important. 